Welcome back to this YouTube channel. Today I'll be showing you all drawings in electrical and mechanical bumbling services. So electrical and mechanical drawings are, um, are actually drawings that um they're actually services drawings rather they they are used for for proper detailing on where electrical fittings and public fittings are to be and to also calculate the loads that will be used especially for electrical drawings so let's start from electrical drawings this is the first page is most times called legend this is the first page of the electrical drawing it shows the note it shows notes on on the electrical drawing it shows some detailed notes that regards to the drawing you can see here all installation shall be in full pvc concealed conduit system so these are different notes a space factor of 60 percent shall be observed in the conduit all 13 amp sealed circuit outlets shall be mounted at 4 mm four feet mm above the finished floor level and shall be connected in ring circuit so these are different different highlighted note that is required in what you have designed you actually write it and you can see at the last one the engineer is not liable for any fault or damage if not invited to supervise electrical construction so you can see the different highlighted note on the first page so this is what the first page is on so you can see also the first page also consists of the legend which shows the symbol and description and the pattern make of every electrical fitting that is to be used in the drawing we'll go back to the next design or the next page of the electrical drawing which is the ground floor plan of the electrical drawing and it's called the powerpoint the powerpoint is the next phase of the electrical drawing which consists of the socket the switch the 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 channels the the water heaters the electrical cars you can see here you can see an electrical car you can see a socket close to it so these are this is actually a 13 amp socket why the black one here the 15 amp socket you can see where the db at the distribution box was proposed to be and in this particular design you can see that it is but it's it's usually written repeat the same year, which shows that this design is kind of similar to each other. So once you have a similar drawing, you can see this one is similar to this. Once you have a similar drawing, you can just repeat, just do repeat the same year to avoid doing drawings over and over again. You can see the next one, the lighting point. This one shows the fan, the switch, the fan, the lightings, the the. The fan, the lighting, of, and bulbs of the house, so of different types and shapes. This particular two double cycled bulbs are at a, a ceiling bulb, while the particular one are a wall bracket, and there are switches, two gang switch. You can also have three gang switch, and what have you. I come to the next one, which is now the upper floor plan of the PowerPoint. This is just the exact copy of what happened at the former one I've showed you. Then we can come now to the calculation, the DB calculation. Here we calculate the distribution box and get and to get the the general the, the, the loadings of the house, the the total load of the house, how many total arms the, the building requires. Every I mean, um, the, the building requires the all the electro, electrical and electronic fittings. How many amps they need to function and to function very well? So you can see, you can also get um, to see a generator loading and what have you. Then you can come with an electric detail. This is a detail in your electrical drawing, a schematic drawing on, on how the electric on how the electric flow goes. From your db to your alcb to your 180p and ember chambers they're not diverted to different phases and then to the eight then the next one is your mechanical drawing mechanical drawing is also called pumbling services it's called pumbling drawings so this is a mechanical drawing the first phase is just the same thing as the mechanic as the electrical drawing where you see your different legend and the note all pipes will be in pvc proper location of the fitting should be determined on site by the architect so you can see the next drawing which has, which has to be with them the next drawing has to do with water supply ground floor plan mechanical drain make water supply so this shows how water is being supplied into the house this shows how water 
so you can see from public mayors to GLT down to UVC pub down to the house so this shows how water is being supplied into the house how water is supplied into the house into different bedrooms and kitchens and what have you in the house this shows how water is being supplied to the house you can see the next one in the ground floor plan which is the drainage supply this shows how water is being supplied out of how the sewage or water is supplied out of the house to the soccer way or the the suck away tank and what have you to this you should sewage water is being supplied out what i mean supplied out of the house this is the ground floor plan of the sewage why this ones are the upper floor plan of the water supply and the sewage of the if you watch if you watch the upper floor plan of the mechanic of the mechanical drain of the water supply you can see that it has pipe it just shows the pipe all these things are pipe it shows that the water is actually coming from down to the up so the last one will actually see the detailed different details of the house different details stock away detail you can see the plan of stock away you can see the section of stock away pit you can see different details you can see the septic tank and what have you these are just the general view of the mechanical and the electrical drain you can flow up on, you can show flow up our youtube channel where you see how to actually design these things and how to comment on the comment, on the comment section like and share this video and most importantly hit on the notifications button to get notified